When someone becomes a Red Lantern, the host of each ring undergoes a massive transformation. The first thing that happens is when the ring latches onto them, their hearts explode, and their blood essentially becomes spoiled with it becoming one of their most deadly weapons. Afterwards, the ring itself kind of acts as their heart, so if you remove a Red Lantern's ring without the healing energy of something like Mogo or a Blue Lantern, they will most certainly die. In addition to those two developments, before Atrocitus decided to throw his subordinates into the blood ocean of Yzmol, every single Red Lantern was a mindless monster. And the only one to really keep their wits about them when becoming a Red Lantern is Jack Moore, who eventually becomes the Red Lantern known as Rancor. And when you become a Red Lantern, you straight up become Nightmare Fuel. Like the minute Jack Moore becomes a Red Lantern, his spine snaps and his hair goes on fire. But what really makes Red Lanterns so complicated and compelling is that genuinely good people can end up on the sides of people who were torturers and murderers, because even good people can have remarkable amounts of rage. Be sure to subscribe and let me know your favorite Red Lantern.